Tennessee State Representative Justin Pearson, who was expelled by Republicans, making a stop in Massachusetts to talk about gun control. Republicans in Montana, they banned a transgender lawmaker, Zoe Zephyr, from the House floor. Marianne, are red state Republicans the best fundraisers Democrats ever had? More important than money, they're showing the country what Republican legislatures are doing across the country to kill our democracy and kill our Constitution, expelling legislators illegally. That is invaluable. Rob? I don't think it's resonating with voters. I think it's Twitter-driven controversy. And Twitter, let's face it, it's basically the graffiti wall for insiders. Which brings us to best or worst week. Rob, let's start with you. The worst week uh, goes to Donald Trump. In New Hampshire this week, he called Joe Biden a threat to democracy. Then in the same speech, he said that the 2020 election was rigged. The only threat to democracy is Donald Trump. We know that's not true, that it was rigged. Maria. Senate Republicans who voted against the Equal Rights Amendment, giving women the rights that men have had for 245 years, 51 years after this effort started, five years after the last state uh, uh, ratified it in the Constitution. The only two Republicans who voted for it, Susan Collins and Lisa Murkowski. Shame on them. Brilliant, which brings us to the end of the program. Marianne, thank you, Rob. Thank you, folks. Thank you for joining us. Remember, every Sunday we go on the record.